Hello, I'm David Gross with Condi Systems, back with you to talk about a new printer in our sublimation world. Our world over the last couple years has been dominated by the Ricoh printers, especially the GX7000 and now the GXE3300. 7000 being the bigger printer, it's the 11 by 17 printer, and with the bypass tray it'll do 13 by 19. Well, before the Ricohs came along, um, our industry was dominated by Epson printers. And I'm here with you today to share with you the Epson WF-1100. WF-1100 um, replaces the, the, in my mind, it replaces the 1400. Before the 1400, we had a printer called the 1280. And so we've gone from the 1280 to the 1400 to the WF-1100. These are Epson printers. They are uh, printers that are capable out of the box of doing 13 by 19. That's a favorite paper size in our industry. Well, why am I talking to you about the WF-1100? Well, it's, we'll call it, it's an economy 13 by 19 printer. And so compared to the, the GX7000, the WF-1100, um, there's about a, in, in my math, there's about a savings of about $400. And for some people getting into sublimation, um, that's a make or break thing, and, and that is. And so if, if for instance, um, a WF-1100 with what we're going to talk about here probably rolls up to be about $900 compared to um, a 7000 um, with the bypass tray, you're, you're probably looking at um, $1,300, $1,400, something like that. And uh, your sales rep at Condi can, can give you exact numbers kind of stuff. I'm more of the, 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 the technical philosophy kind of person. And so um, with it being a fair bit less than the 7,000, that may fit your budget um, and you know, say you grow into a 7,000. And so what I want to do is share with you a little bit about what the WF-1100 solution is. Essentially it's a printer. It does 13 by 19 out of the box and it's what we would refer to as a five color printer and meaning that it has CMY and then it has two blacks so two blacks plus CMY and give us the five color so Epson designed the printer to be um, faster in, in doing simple black and white things as opposed to color so the WF-1100 is considerably slower than its Ricoh printers but it still gets the job done the RICO would probably print a letter page in 25 seconds. This is going to take about two and a half minutes. Um, a RICO would print 11 by 17 in, say, 45 seconds. This one would take um, a little less than five minutes. So th there is a big speed difference, but again, um, the WF-1100 is just a, um, it's a savings in money for people that it fits the budget. Um, and so what the printer consists of is, is obviously the printer. Um, and it's about a $200 printer, so it's really a great printer for the money. And then we need to add to it a bulk ink system. The cartridges in this printer, um, if you were to use them, so forth, with, with what you get, it's really not a good deal uh, because the cartridges are very small and you're, you're not going to get good economy for your money. And so you need to buy a bulk ink system. The printer comes with two options. One is an artanium option, the other is a sublegit. Um, I'm more of an artanium fan just because that's what I've done all these years than, than the sublegit IQ. Both are good systems. Um, the main difference between the two is the artanium uses an ICC profile and the sublegit IQ um, uses the power driver. So um, what I have here is the artanium system. And the artanium system uh, bolts onto the printer and it's it's easy system to bolt onto it and then the tubes are filled with ink now if we open up the the cover here of the bulk ink system what you'll find is that there's four bags of ink and these these inks um, feed through the tubes and then they go over to the printer um, where the inks are routed and they come down here uh, to where the cartridges are now inside here we have five cartridges the CMY plus two blacks, and there's a little divider in here that gives us two black ink lines right here. You can see two black ink lines. And so um, the system sits beside the printer and just feeds it ink. Um, and then the cartridge is there. Um, 
the cartridges emulate Epson cartridges. And so after a while, the cartridges think they're empty, and there's a little reset button um, right, right to the back of where the black cartridge is, and you push that, and the cartridges reset so the printer thinks you've installed new cartridges. Um, we've tested the printer for a while and found it to be a, a good printer, a reliable printer, um, and certainly, you know, for folks that, that are really on a strong budget looking for a uh, B-size printer, um, this printer it, it definitely does the job, okay? Um, the, um, the ink system comes in a little box here, comes with good instructions, um, and of course here at Condi we'll walk you through the installation. The printer is a USB printer, and then we provide an ICC profile on the Artanium side that's configured essentially the same way as we do all the other printers. So again, I wanted to introduce the WF-1100, in this case with the Artanium bulk ink system, the bags of ink. Um, I think it's, it's, a, it's a worthy system to add to our line for folks that are on, on a budget but, but have to have um, that magic 13 by 19 uh, paper size. This has been David Gross with Condi Systems. Feel free to email me at dgross at condi.com. Always look forward to your comments and questions. Thank you for watching.